This video will demonstrate the integration between RevealX360 Network Detection and Response from ExtraHop and the CrowdStrike Falcon Intelligence Threat Intelligence Service. We'll look at what it looks like to investigate a detection of network threat behavior from RevealX360 that's correlated with an ind indicator of compromise, such as a known bad IP address or domain from CrowdStrike's Falcon Intelligence Service. I've started out on the Security Overview page in RevealX360, and I'll quickly jump to the detections page here. I will have a list of all the network threat detections in RevealX360. For the selected time window, I'm going to choose to investigate a data exfiltration detection. Now, I've got more than one of these here, and as I scroll down, I can see that one of these threat detections has a View Threat Intelligence Indicator on it with a small security camera icon, meaning that there's an indicator of compromise involved in this detection. If I hover over that, I'll get a little popover showing some more information about the threat intelligence that was involved here. But first, let's dig in a little deeper into the network details and context provided by RevealX360 around this detection. Here you can see the offender and the victim that were involved in this data exfiltration detection, a sequence of related detections showing what happened before this and what happened after it involving the same victims and defenders, or a sequence of victims and defenders and you can get down to further network details, including the full packet capture. Now in a real security incident, this level of detail that we've already shown would potentially allow the analyst to stop the attack from progressing to the point of data exfiltration. But for the purposes of this demo, we've allowed the attack to proceed all the way through so we can demonstrate the amount of detail that ExtraHop and CrowdStrike can provide together during any actual security attack. Now let's dig into the threat intelligence. You can see if I hover again, I'll get that same popover menu with various details. If I click on it, I'll get an expanded dialog that shows more details, including a link to the CrowdStrike Falcon interface so that you can investigate this indicator of compromise from the CrowdStrike perspective and see any details they have available there. I can click to exit that and go back to my popover dialog, and you can see that I've got some other investigation options here. I can click RN Who Is Lookup to get any publicly available details about this suspicious IP address, or I can click Records or even Packets to get further network forensic detail about this particular indicator of compromise. If I click into Records, I'll get a list of transaction records that RevealX360 has captured about the communications with this indicator of compromise. You can see each of these records has a great deal of detail with it, and they each have the security camera icon indicating that this is a communication between a host inside our environment with a known suspicious host, an indicator of compromise from Falcon Intelligence. With one more click, I can query the packets for all displayed records and get down to the actual packets that were transmitted to this indicator of compromise. And if those were encrypted, I would be able to download the session keys to decrypt them as well as to get full forensic details and achieve total confidence about exactly what data from my environment was transmitted to this known suspicious IP or domain. As you can see, we've brought together a great deal of network detail and context with endpoint details and context from the CrowdStrike Falcon platform. Together, ExtraHop and CrowdStrike provide full coverage security built for when seconds matter so that you can stop breaches faster. Get a free trial of RevealX360 Network Detection and Response by visiting the CrowdStrike App Store.